Well, in general, of course, regulation does help insurance perform its vital international function because, very simply, it is creating greater trust in the product and helping people understand and relate to it and trust it. So this makes a huge difference. That said, in recent years, I think, there have been challenges. There's been a desire to make insurance and reinsurance companies so safe that they aren't as innovative, they aren't as able to be helpful as they were before. And so I think there's a challenge to get the balance just right, and hopefully we will continue to see progress towards that balance. You know, um, there's been great progress in the international coordination of regulation. Supervisory colleges are much more effective. The recent covered agreement between the EU and the United States was proposed. These are very good steps forward. That said, you know, with a change in the administration, I would expect there would be more attention, for example, in the United States um, to the state regulatory system. That will be a bit of a challenge to incorporate interna international activity. At the same time, Brexit is uncertain for everyone, and we're just going to have to wait and see how the EU and the UK work that out. Well, this is where innovation is so important. You know, the, the, this is where I would encourage that as we think about capital standards, we think about making sure that the charges for innovative products are done in a thoughtful way. This will require real attention. The industry has been trying to be more innovative. I think we've made good progress, but we're nowhere near where we need to be. Risks are going to continue to evolve. Insurance companies and reinsurance companies will need to continue to evolve, and we need to make sure that the regulatory standards are flexible enough to allow for such innovation. Meetings like Progre and, and such forum, any forum where we can get to understand each other's point of view more richly is going to be very valuable. The fact is that if we're in a common effort to try and make insurance and reinsurance more valuable to society, that, that is a common goal of the insurers, the reinsurers, and the regulators. And the more we have dialogue, understand where each other's coming from, and really deeply understand how to get the rate of innovation we need, I think the better off we'll be.